About a month ago, we talked about how Donald Trump was once again trolling libs about how he might just run for a third term because, you know, if a president is treated so poorly, then I think maybe there's a case to be made that you are entitled to run for a third term. So he made that joke. The libs were triggered expectedly. And, you know, it's it's all fun and games. But he's joking about it once again, that maybe he wants to run for a third term. And I use the word joke really loosely because even though that's kind of the excuse from the right when he says things like this i don't actually think he's joking i think that he genuinely wants to run for a third term assuming he's able to win a second term but he did it again take a look at 52 days from now we're going to win nevada and we're going to win four more years in the white house and then after that we'll negotiate right because we're probably Based on the way we were treated, we're probably entitled to another four after that. And it should never happen to another president. It's just a dishonest group of people. Yeah, I'm triggered. He's trolling. Master troll. At some point, like, you can't use, oh, he's just kidding, as an excuse. This is the president of the United States. There's no clause in the 22nd Amendment that says that a president can only serve two terms unless he thinks that people were mean to him. Then he gets to make the case for himself about a possible third or fourth term. Like, that's not a thing. And I think that using joking or trolling as an excuse is not acceptable. And I'm not trying to be like the tone police or engage in respectability politics because if there's anything I don't care about, it's decorum or norms. But this isn't about just Trump being mean and putting out mean tweets and being unpresidential. This is about a sitting president saying, I'm going to ignore the Constitution and I'm going to effectively become a dictator. I'm going to seek out a third term. Again, I always make this point, but I think it's an important point, albeit a hacky one, but I mean, it's... It's something that we all know would happen. If Hillary did this, if Obama did this, they would lose their shit on the right. But because Trump does it, they're okay with it. So it's not surprising, but this is one of those things where I don't think we should allow it to be a normal thing under Donald Trump. Because Donald Trump might not necessarily be competent enough to actually be a dictator and turn the United States into a full-fledged authoritarian regime, even if we are on track to become that. But someone more competent, a fascist who actually isn't an idiot, will come along and do it. Trump's just kind of warming them up to that idea. So, I mean, we should never allow this to be a common thing. And whenever he does this, don't let him get away with just saying, oh, this is a joke. Or don't let his supporters just say, you know, he's just kidding. Are you triggered? No, that's fucking stupid. This is the president. You can't be joking about being a dictator. And I don't even believe that you're joking. I think he's being serious. I think he believes he actually can make a case to run for a third term because people were mean to him. I mean, what a fucking idiot. If you are joking, then it's not very funny. But if you are being serious, then you're just entitled and you're a wannabe dictator. Girly Mike Fettuccini needs your support on Patreon. What a loser. Visit patreon.com slash humanist report to support the low ratings humanist report. Sad. My views are much higher. <laughs>